Oh, whatever. We'll do one more. Wow, still the Imperial side. I thought for sure we were going to be on Team Rebel. The Nadiri dockyards are burning. Their Starhawk flees before us. Linden and Vanguard are within our reach. Vengeance is sweet, isn't it? But this is no time yeah. to get complacent. I've waited too long to let Linden slip away again. Admiral Sloan is adamant that the Starhawk be destroyed, but we cannot engage it directly. The tractor beam is too powerful. You Instead, could send fighters. We must force them into the Ringali Nebula. This... There, Vanguard and their battleship will be erased from history. But we have the Beredi has called us to serve. We cannot fail. I had it down to like half. <laughs> All right. Let's hear your nebula plan. You have done well, Titan Squadron. But in order to stop them, I need you to break off from the Overseer and fly ahead of the enemy fleet to set a trap. LT-514's calculations indicate that the remains of the Nadiri fleet is attempting to reach the New Republic capital of Chandrala. The to remains so, are? They must navigate the junkyard of scrapped Imperial ships they've been using to build that monstrous Starhawk. Poetic. <laughs> They'll it? join it. We've detected several reactor cores in the junkyard. Titan, fly ahead of their fleet and use the cores to create a minefield on their path. Okay. Active cores will detonate when shot and devastate any ships nearby. That includes you. Wield this advantage cautiously. Destroy any Republic starfighters attempting to scout the dangers of the debris field. Your ties alone may struggle against the fleet's larger ships. Detonate the cores to take them out. If all goes according to plan, a Starhawk will either be destroyed in your minefield or be forced to divert into the deadly Ringali Nebula. Either way, we win. All right. Oh. You're authorized to fly a TIE bomber or a TIE reaper. <laughs> um. Well, all right, I enjoyed the multi-lock missile, I'm not going to lie. Uh, proton bomb's not happening. Let's, okay, let's do the multi-lock and that. Got chaff, sure. All right, you can make the case that the other boost engine that recharges faster uh, be more compatible with my style. But we'll, we'll, we'll keep it simple. See if I can fly Squadron, into me. here. We're approaching the junkyard now. Nah, it looks like a no. This isn't just a junkyard, Valka. It's an Imperial graveyard. How many different destroyers do you think they left out here? And what did the Republic do to their crews? Doesn't matter. We can't change what happened. All we can do now is deliver vengeance. Oh, he's gonna defect. We're done today. This will be a rebel graveyard too. Yeah. Over 
us here. We've reached the target destination. The enemy is advancing as expected. You have time to prepare our trap. Copy that. Let's find those reactor cores. Remember, only active cores are explosive. And the rest are useless duds. Understood. That core isn't active, so it's useless to us. Right. Destroy it and move on. Oh. Shouldn't I scan the cores? How exactly are we rigging these cores to explode? We're not. The active cores are volatile. It only takes a few shots to detonate them. So the rebels inadvertently created their own minefield. I love it. Active core. Good find. It's a dud. The proximity sensors on active cores will alert us to enemies in range of our explosives. If you hear the alarm, a ship is inside the kill zone. That's when we attack the cores and detonate. Explosive core located. Titan 3 found an explosive core. I found three. Excellent. It's time, squadron. Enemy starfighters have entered your minefield. Affirmative overseer. Titan, engage and eliminate. Stray shots can cost us our cores. Precision above all else, pilots. All right. Titan 3. Let's cut down these fighters. Enemy locked on. That's the best you got. Oh, okay. I was shooting too close to the explosives. I was freaking out a little bit. Also, when you have the assault shield up, you can't really steer. Republic Corvettes are on the approach. Then we need to pick up the pace. Nearly shot that interceptor. We're with you. For a dog fight. Titan three, when their ships are in range, detonate the cores. Follow me. Okay. I'm with you. Fighter is damaged. Yeah. Get him? The core, now. I did! It's a moose? I don't know, but it's loose in the hoose. I'm blowing these things up very uncomfortably close to me. Titan. We cannot let the Corvettes cross this debris field. Let's get more aggressive then. 
Yeah, I'm gonna die though. You know, for the Empire, but. I can't! There we go. See, it's just not that much damage. You know, uh, just got a little. Oh, they're just all active. Please target the thing directly in front of me. There we go. They're on me. That one is active. That's active. They're locked on. Oh, they're persistent. Perfect. I say you owe me one. All right. Don't disagree. It's no concussion missile, but I think we did some damage there. Do it again? Do we have enough cores to take them out? We better. Yeah, I don't know. I can damage. They got a lock on me. Detonate the core now. Appreciate
All right, okay, the strategy is a bit better than I gave you credit for. I see now what they had in mind. I think we have another wave, but they're maybe a little bit further ahead. Watch out. Enemies pursuing. Yeah! Only one corvette left. It worked! Success! Right? I've killed a lot of people today. Goodness. These fools, they underestimate Imperial superiority. Superior strength, superior ingenuity. True, but they are not fools. The Starhawk couldn't cross this field without knowing what it was flying into. If the New Republic is willing to sacrifice this much, what does that tell you about the value of the Starhawk? They're going to be devastated when we destroy it. Okay, it is the frigate. All right, can we can we get it with the reactor core? I wonder. All right. Time to get out of here. Threat's gone. Keep fighting. Fine now. Thanks. Kill that core. Kill those rebels. I need repairs from my friend. Yeah. <laughs> That's all right. Oh, we did it just in time. We need to fly ahead and find more cores. It's the only way to stop the frigate. And next time we'll get the shield up before. There's a cluster of cores dead ahead. I mean, can't we just sort of when the frigate is that cluster shoot them on a prayer? Titan 3, scan that core cluster to ensure it's active. Oh, I got its shields back though. Yeah, it looks like the right time. Boom. <clears throat> well, the rebels took a lot of losses today. Man, where was it this whole time? 
Yeah, cause everyone died. We've diverted the rebels toward the Ringali Nebula. This is where Lyndon James and his wretched Starhawk will die. Oof. Well, pretty good aside from that. <laughs> the destroyer was at the far edge. Yeah, I just, you know, you can use the destroyer to destroy things. Alright. We had a good run. I think we switched back to Rebels after this. Oh, what a great game. We'll do this again soon. Thanks for watching, everybody. We've like blitzed through like a third of the campaign in this stream. So I think we'll wrap it next time. Maybe we'll see. They do get like, you can tell there's sort of set pieces they want to do. Um, you know, just like the blowing up the cores or whatever. So we'll have a bit more of that. But some good general missions as well. Thanks for joining me. Who <laughs> would win? Four TIE pilots or a rebel fleet? Do the TIE pilots have cores? <laughs>